Hi, welcome to Tech Tips and Tech Stuff. My name is Ron, and today is Movie Studio Mondays, where I help people using Movie Studio. And today we're using Movie Studio 16 Platinum. And what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be playing with the audio and doing special effects with audio. So right now, right after saying now, my voice is now speaking in a high pitch. Now, I sound like an AM radio. Now I'll show you how to do these. Very simple. Okay, we're in Movie Studio 16 Platinum right now. And I have my clip dragged to the timeline. To make this editing a little easier, let's make this a little larger. So you can click the little plus icon here. Or you can use the wheel on your mouse, the scroll wheel. And make it a little, a little wider. Just so you can edit the audio better. So let's play this back. Hi, welcome to Tech Tips and Tech Stuff. My name is Ron. And today is Movie Studio Mondays. Where I help people using Movie Studio. And today we're using Movie Studio 16 Platinum. And what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be playing with the audio and doing special effects with audio. So right now, right after saying now, my voice is now speaking in a high pitch. Okay, so let's go back here and find out where I start saying this. So right now, right after saying now, put that in pause, hit the S key on your keyboard to split, split both the audio and video track. Here's where I end it, and the S key is split it. Go to Event FX. If you don't see any effects up here, double click All, and then it should all show up. So the first one you want is Pitch Shift. So double click that. And we're going to select Third Up. Now it's important, to make your voice be in sync with the video, you have to select Pres Preserve Duration. So we play this back, sound like this. My voice is now speaking in a high pitch. Okay, so that's one effect. My voice is now speaking in a high pitch. Now, I sound like an AM radio. Okay, so let's put this one here. Let's put this one here. Go to event effects. Double click on Resonant Filter and select Teenage Late Night Radio by the Bed. Put this back. I sound like an AM radio. So playing both of them back. My voice is now speaking in a high pitch. Now. I sound like an AM radio. So that's all you have to do to do special effects to your audio track. What you can do is just experiment with the different settings and the different uh, effects in there and just get something that you like. But make sure when you're doing like this one here, we have to preserve duration. Or if you don't do that, your voice is going to be out of sync with the video. That's one thing you have to be sure you always do is preserve duration on there. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. New videos every Monday, Tuesday, and Friday. So once again, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.